Southeast Austin family woke up to the sound of pounding on their window this morning. A neighbor was trying to tell them the house was on fire, and we have learned fire investigators are still not sure what caused it. While a lot was lost, KXAN's Amanda Brandeis explains why the small neighborhood still has a lot to be thankful for. The home of six people left disfigured by flames. I was scared. My heart was racing 10 million miles an hour. Chad Harrigan saw the orange glow from his living room. When I looked out the window, I just saw flames shooting from the porch, and I ran over and banged on the living room window. Knowing three children and three of his close friends were inside the home, his heart pounded faster. With no working fire alarms in the house, his voice was their lifeline. And I saw her open up the front door and the flames came into the living room. And then she got all of the kids and went to the back of the house. By the time we got out there, it was already, you know, up in flames and we just wanted to get the kids away further. And a gift the kids woke up to on Christmas morning burned alongside it. When I told her about the playscape, she just went into hysterics. And then I told her Flippy was missing and she had just got the boys, that dog. But Harrigan says seeing the fire when he did was fate because typically he's already at work by that time. If it wasn't for him waking her up, you know, who knows what would happen. And the fear of losing their canine family member soon turned into relief. There's only three homes up here. We're away from the road, but yeah, we do watch out for one another. The family lost a lot. But as they try to move forward, they at least have each other. Amanda Brandeis, KXAN News. Three of the children and one adult were taken to the hospital this morning for smoke inhalation. Fire officials tell us they have since been released. Four 